Hey there folks, this is GreenyXI welcoming you right back to Let's Play Suikoden, this is episode 24. In the last episode, we made our way through the major battle which got us to the northern checkpoint, and then from there we went to Moravia, I think it was a castle meant to be, um, which is where we saved our good friend Victor and Warren and quite a few other people. <laughs> where we left off, I had to come to check out the boat, so let's do that now. Take a look at this boss, the medical officer sure has some crazy ideas. No kidding, use my thrash for something like this. Commander Greeny, please take a look at this. It's made out of ice. They froze it by using a dragon's breath. Incredible, it's floating all right, and pretty sturdy too. Yeah, let's get on it. <laughs> As promised, we have prepared 500 boats. We now await your orders, Commander Greeny. Uh, yeah, I just saved, so let's get going. Another major battle now. It's not the last major battle, I think there's one more after it. In order to get to the final dungeon, I, I'm pretty sure. So here we go. It's the same strategy as we used last time, but this time it's going to go on a bit longer because they've got more, more, um, more units. I swear by my name of Sonia Shulan that I will defend the floating fortress. Hey, you're pretty cute. Right. <laughs> <laughs> How dare you, you impertinent scoundrel. A lop off your head. Yeah, you big poof. Right, okay. So we're going to kick things off. Step one. Always do it exactly the same. Dragon Knights. Get some damage in there. Yeah, yeah, you're proud of your dragons, Joshua. I get it. Nice. Look at that amount of damage I just did. Turn two. We're going to use Kane at Cage. As a ninja, to go and see what they're doing. There's no point using thieves anymore. You've got ninjas, you know. 100% success rate and all that. What are they going to do? Charge attack. So against the charge attack, we use a bit of magic. Uh, yeah, children of the runes, why not? With the old man, you know, children. <laughs> May the hundred runes within me. I like how they do a sort of circle formation for a spell. It's like a hex, you know? Uh, we're going to do the same again, but this time it's going to be Kasimi instead of Cage. Okay, you can take care of it. I've already said you can. The enemy's next plan is Sonya's Charge, which is just another charge. It, it's got a different name, but it's just another charge, so Magicians again. I see. So you want to see my magic? Yeah, I do, actually. Okay, it's another four... 4,000 gone. Turn 4. Get our next spy on the go. Uh, yeah, here we go. Let me take care of it, sir. <laughs> What's he going to do? Yeah, man, that bow attack. So if he's going to use a bow attack, we want to charge, right? But if we're going to charge, we might as well increase our attack power first. Why not? <laughs> so our main our main party is now the most powerful again with Greeny in it. So we've got an extra character in instead of Gremio. Oh no, the knight's part the knight's party is more powerful. Where's our main team then? Where's Greeny? There he is. Oh still a bit shit. Oh, never mind then. Let's get the best one on the go. The knight's party. No point using anything but the best. Yeah. It's weird how they don't get anyone with their bow and arrows. Like they're charging right at them, you'd think they would. <laughs> but yeah, well done. Not difficult when you know to use spies. As long as you've been recruiting, you know, recruiting. Yep, we did win. Thank you. Yeah, we did it. Simple times. I am so sorry, Master Teo. Don't worry, Tio's dead. He, he won't mind. Right, so I am going to... No, I'm not going to save a sec. What I'm going to do, because God knows we're going to need to... Oh, uh, let me think. Come on, let's, let's get this bit of plot out of the way a sec. Unload the oil barrels. Commander Greeny, we'll burn this fortress down with oil. 
To do so, you must go and close the floodgate at the far end of the fortress. As soon as it's closed, we'll pour the oil and set the fortress on fire. At the far end of the fortress? Yes, Kasumi has already scouted the area. Please choose your men. Let's get going. Okay, Victor's coming. Thank God. Greeny, Humphrey and I are going to pursue the survivors. Okay, so we haven't got Flick or Humphrey, I guess. But <laughs> Right, okay. So who should we take? My recommendation, obviously Hero and Victor, we got to have. So, I'm going to take Kai as well, for obvious reasons that we've seen throughout the series. Just the Unite with Greeny and Kai is amazing. And will help us so much through this, if I can find Kai. Where are you? Oh, I lost him. Crap. Ah, oh, there he is. <sighs> I was wondering where he was then. Alright, so we'll have him. We'll go for Luke again. I know this is a weird choice because he's such a shit attacker, even up on really high sharpness for weapons. And he's short range. And he's a mage. <laughs> um, next up, we'll go for Hicks and... Um, Hicks and Tengo. So, yeah, we'll go for those two because they have a move that they can do together as well. So it's good to, it's good to have, you know, Tenga, and they're not too far behind on levels either. So I like Tenga as a character as well. Her design, more than anything, Hicks. There we go. That's what I wanted. So have we got much equipment on him a sec? I don't expect we have. Oh, no. I'm going to have to go back to HQ and sort all this out, I think. Mm, yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll see you in a sec. Okay, so I've gotten us back to this place. Sh Shazaraza. Oh. <laughs> Shazaraza. Shazaraza? There we go. This is what I've done. I think a couple of their levels are a bit low. I'd rather everyone be up at about level 50 at least. But that's why I've done it. Formation-wise... It made sense to me. Luke is in the back row. Could swap him for Greeny, I guess. But I'd rather... Mm, should we? Luke will at least be able to get some damage in. But no. This place is a tough place and it's got two bosses. Like, I think it's the only place in the game that has that many bosses. But here's the equipment. I don't know if it's the best. But it's what I got. <laughs> so, let's get cracking. I got all the weapons up to level 16 as well. Except for... Hicks, who's on level 15. I do have my reasons for that. We'll get on to that. Okay. Ooh, how do we go over to that chest? Oh, bleh, the path. <laughs> okay, first enemies. Elite soldiers. There's quite a few of them, so I'm going to use United. Same by yet. It'll attack all of them as... No, I won't. It'll only attack one of them. Doesn't really matter which one I go for, I'm not too bothered. I don't want to use any MP along the way though, because I want to store it for the for the bosses. Oh here we go. <laughs> They're doing decent damage. I got plenty of medicines and stuff. And we got a healer, a really good healer on us in Luke. So I think we'll be alright. No oh god, they're all attacking Victor. Alright. There we go. Most of them just went up to above level level fifty anyway, except for Tenga. So yeah, it was worth level grinding, can just come here and do it really quick. So what I wanna do now got plenty of mega medicines, we just got three more still, so I think they're gonna drop pretty often. Is that enough? Yeah, that'll do. Ooh. What's actually in the chest? Chaos Shield. Okay, if we go anyone who needs a shield, I don't think we do. No, Hicks has already got that one on him, so that's fine. Just a heads up, when we go for the final dungeon, we won't be using Hicks, we'll be using um, Flick instead, so that's just a heads up. Okay. Unite. Unite. They might as well all go for that, right? Hmm. No, actually. We won Unite the second time. This way, we get two attacks instead of one, double the chance of crits, and it should be enough to kill off two of the enemies instead of just the one from that one warrior, warrior attack. Oh, I didn't kill him. 
Okay. I was wrong then. Hey, it's double attack. I forgot the add that. We put it on him before he left, didn't we? That rune. The double beat. This is a good amount of EXP we get. Oh, horned, helm horned helmets. We need them. Who had it? Okay, it was you. Only Hicks can equip it. So we got the only one we need to get off him. So that's good. Just had to be for the character I'm not going to bloody use later on. But all right, that's fine. Let's go. The enemies around you that uh, drop sound settings as well, if you're looking for all of those. And it's also enemies who drop um, flowing crystals. I'm not entirely sure what they do. Guard rings, we've got plenty of them. We don't need any more for this party. Alright, just the two of you this time, is it? Let's unite. And then attack all the way. You can see how much of a difficulty spike this place is, just because... In, in like the last place we were in, that Unite attack was killing all enemies in one go, pretty much, wasn't it? So it's, it's got that jump in it. Master Garb. Good. We're getting some good equipment that we can't buy now, so... Skill bonus. Ooh, greeny. I want... I want him to have that, so... If we go... We could just drop the guard ring. Money isn't really something I really... No, we won't drop it. We'll keep it. We will sell it. I'm being a bit... <laughs> a bit funny with my money. So... That's a pretty good increase too. And then we'll give the dragon armor over to anyone just to have a bit of space. There we go. Ooh, just as we were about to leave. Free will. Let's see how it turns out. Yeah, one down. That's good. <laughs> That's not so good. <laughs> oh, Christ. They're getting a few counters in. I'll do it. I will heal up a little bit now, though. It's a good job we got so much medicine, though. With the bosses coming up. Um... Okay, that'll do. Left or right, left or right. Oh. <laughs> we'll have a fight first, then we'll decide. We've got so much MP, we could be using a couple of spells. But the thing is, the weaker spells are pretty bloody bad by this point. It's just not that worthwhile even using them. When your physical attacks are just better. There you go. Nice, we're getting plenty of money here. We're back up above 100,000, which is what I wanted. Let's try left. Well, it's only left. Right is blocked off. I didn't notice. I think down would be the right way to go there. So, yeah, here was. Mega medicine. Yay! More for greenie. We just used the last of us, so yay. But what I will do is give one of them over to uh, who, 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 who. Luke can heal anyway, so somebody else. Tenga, I guess? Why not? Oh, Sirens. These are the ones that drop the sound settings and the flowing crystals. All right, let's see how this turns out. I think they're going to be weaker health-wise than the, yeah, defensively at least, than the soldiers, I was going to say. There are four of them there, so any drops? Nah. A lot of money, though. 24,000. There you are. Boss number one of two. So against this thing, what I'm going to do, I'm going to save all my judgment spells for the next boss, because that's going to be tougher. This one, though. Hmm. How, how should we go about there? We're going to use... <laughs> We're just going to attack. For you and you, because you get double attack. You, I want to use the United Warriors attack. That's what I brought you for. And you, hmm. 
Let me think. Yeah, you can use you can use Storm. You've got plenty of MP. I know it's your most powerful spell and using it early. Ooh, nice crit. Yeah, that was the spell that a boss was using against us. Wasn't it Necklord? Nice. Two crits, a unite attack. We just did a shit ton of damage in one round. That was a fair amount against everyone, mind. Hmm. I probably should have healed up before coming in. That would have been a bit a bit of common sense on my part, wouldn't it? Okay. And as for you, Kai, you can... Mm, no. Attack. And as for you, you can use Healing Wind. Let's show up. Show up. Oh, it's only healing one person. I could have sworn it was a party. Mm, that's not good. It's not what I ex was expecting. Okay, Kai. I'll have to get you using the Mega Medicine on Luke. And you can use a Mega Medicine on Hicks. Let's hope this works out, because we haven't got a way of reviving after the boss. Okay, and his attack missed, or her attack missed, if seems like more of a who. Okay, so we're going to do pretty much the same thing again this time. Only this time... Mm, okay, yep. Yeah. Mega Medicine on yourself, and Luke, you can use a Mega Medicine on... Tenga. With the amount of damage we're doing, I don't think it'll be long before he's dead. Right, she's doing the zappy zap. We've kept health up enough to get through it, so that's fine. Right, just get back to attacks. Nope, unite. What are we looking at here? I think... I want to be safe. Victor. And yourself. Wow. He's got a lot of health. Oh, crap. A lot of MP, too, apparently. Look at our characters. Sugar. Okay. Right, what can we do by you? We need three... Three, pa three party members healing. So, right, Greeny, you're going to get on a bit of healing this time. You can heal Kai, attack, unite. Kai has been healed, Hicks. And mm, yourself, yeah. When they're going below 200 health, that's when I'm doing the healing. Ah, good. <laughs> Just attack the one of us. Alright, so. Yep, let's keep healing. You can heal yourself. You attack. You unite. What got by you? Um, Tengar. Oh, it's still alive. Bloody hell, man. Alright, so it's only Victor only healing, so that's not so bad. Do you know what I'll do this time? Since only one character needs healing, we'll try out Healing Wind. Please be a good healer. Yeah. Oh, good. So, that's a pretty much a full heal with Healing Wind. So, now we get full-on damage this turn, I think. And Storm with you. Yeah, 304 damage and that good, but it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, we're done. Oh, that was a corker. 100,000 bits. Not bad. I want to get the chest. I'll go close the floodgate. You wait here, Greeny. Okay. That was a nice climbing animation. Okay, 
This should do. Now all we have to do is escape and burn this place down. Okay, let's see what's in the chest a sec. Thunder crystal. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, there are also enemies around here called Kerberos that we haven't seen to come across as we come here. They drop gold necklaces if you're interested. So, what we're going to do now is try and leave. I can't remember exactly where the boss shows up. So let's use a spell a sec. I want to sort out our meds medicines so that they're good and spread out. Well, oh. So let's heal up a bit. Alright, that'll do, I think. So let's have a look at our stuff. Loads of mega medicines everywhere. The thing is, these two are going to be used in Unite a lot, so maybe I should be doing this more? Definitely, Luke. We'll need some. Give some to Kai. I think that's how I'd like to go about it. Alright, I'll see you when the next boss shows up. Here we go. Just leaving. <laughs> Wait a minute, Greeny. I must ask you something. I didn't heal up Victor and stuff. No, I did heal up Victor. It's someone I didn't heal up. You're that Imperial leader. Yes, I'm the last of the five great Imperial generals. I want to ask you, Greeny, why did you betray the Empire? Why did you betray your own father, Teo? Inciting rebellion, causing war, taking lives. Is this what you call justice? It doesn't really matter what you say. It's not true. What? Uh-oh, the fire's coming through. We're still in here. Why is the oil already lit? It's too early. The all-consuming flame. Is this your answer? Is this what you want? You raised your sword against Teo. You will pay now with your life. Boss number two. Okay, I don't feel good about not being fully healed coming in, but we do have a few meds since I got some more on the way in. So now, we're on the second boss, we can start using... Should we try Judgment out? The new one that we got off Ted? Just attack with you. Unite with you. Attack with Kai. And as for you, I want to use... Storm. Storm? Yeah, Storm. Thing is, Luke does learn another spell, which is even better, a better healing one than I'm pretty sure it hits your entire party. Wow! One half thousand! Insane. Absolutely insane. <laughs> Versus 306, a fifth of the damage, pretty much. Nice, we just did a ton of damage that turn. Does anyone need healing? Not really. We'll do the same again then, I guess. Unite. Yeah, go on. Have another storm. Hee <laughs> hee. She's just doing physical attacks. I mean... Is it going a bit easier on you with this boss? Just because you've already had a boss and you've had to go through the dungeon and back. Is that what's happened? Did Victor just die? He did, at the very end of the fight. <laughs> oh, shit. Didn't get many bits out of it, either. As I thought, I cannot defeat you. After all, you beat Teo. Yeah. But I will not let you defile me. I'm the Empire's, His Highness's, Teo's. Stop it, what are you doing? Can't let a pretty lady like you die. Besides, you seem to have your reasons. Greenie, we'll take this woman general with us. Okay, come with us then. Let's get out here. At least we survived. At least the flames didn't get us. Master Matthew, Master Matthew. Master Matthew. What happened? Are you alright? What did happen? Sanchez, damn you. What have you done? Why do you light the oil before receiving orders? Answer me, Sanchez. I'm sorry, Master Flick. I've been deceiving you all this time. He was the spy they were talking about. What? I've been in the employ of the Emperor since the War of Succession, seven years ago. Then you're the spy? That's right. In the days of the War of Succession, His Majesty was a wonderful man. And like everyone else, I swore allegiance to him. When the hideout was attacked in Odessa. Are you to blame for Odessa's death? 
That was the result, I won't deny it. But my heart was in pain. Being with you people, I began to question myself. Who's right? What should I do? Ultimately, I chose to remain loyal to the Emperor. At my age, it's difficult to change one's way of life. I'm sorry about Lady Olesa. Don't you dare mention her name. You haven't the right. I understand. I will not forgive you. In the name of my sword, Odessa, I will take your head. Yes, Master, I have no regrets, but please remember one thing. I like you, all of you. Master Flick, you are immature, but that immaturity, that honesty, was something I coveted. And I'm sure that is why Lady Odessa loved you. Sanchez, prepare to die. Wait. How can you forgive him? Master Matthew, you all right? If you kill Sanchez now, and the troops find out that he was a spy, the morale of the Liberation Army will plummet. Administer the punishment later. Right now, we must prepare the army and march to Gregminster. Don't be ridiculous, Master Matthew. You're badly injured if you move. There's a thing called flow in this world. There's a thing called timing in warfare. If we lose this opportunity, we'll never defeat the Empire. Commander Greeny, you must decide. In any case, we better return to the castle. Hmm. Christ. <laughs> God damn it, Sanchez. <laughs> Oh, oh, we can move. I wasn't sure. This is where, the point where you need to have all of your, your stars with you. So, what we're going to do before anything else, I want to go up and check on the star wall. I'm trying to think which one is it. Is it third floor? I think it might be. Um, Yeah, here it is. Recruit as many stars as you can. I know that, huh? It's not giving me any hints or anything. Right, have we got them all? Let's double check. Got all of these. Obviously, Gremio's dead. You can't do anything about that. <clears throat> <clears throat> so we haven't got the Tenju star, which we'll be getting. Don't worry. I will Google that now in between this episode and the next one, to be honest. But just want to make sure. No gaps anyway. Doesn't seem to be. Right, Tenju Star. Give me a sec. I'll do it now, actually. Okay, yeah, we are meant to be missing one. We're going to get it in a sec. So, what I want to do now is head on up to Matthew. Oh, God, Sanchez is still there. What's he doing there? <laughs> Commander Greeny, Shasaraza. Zada has fallen, and the way to the capital is clear. Now's the time to gather our forces and attack Gregminster, the final dungeon. Commander, please give me the order to march forward. Let me tell you something as a doctor. I won't let Matthew go to battle. But I must. I have my responsibilities. I swore to my sister Odessa. <laughs> I pressed that by accident. March to the capital. Thank you, Commander Greeny. A force of 20,000 remains in the capital. They'll be desperate and dangerous. Please assemble all Liberation Army troops. We must raise their morale. The troops are assembled, medical officer. Commander Greeny, let's begin. Warriors of the Liberation Army, the time has come. The end is near for the cruel Imperial Regime. Think of your friends, your families, fight for them. The ground quakes with the anger of the people. Their cries echo in the heavens. Now is the time for this to end. Yeah, it is. Greeny, the time has come to tell you everything. My sister Windy is looking for vengeance against the entire world. Hundreds of years ago, my ancestors, the clan of the gate, were powerful people. <laughs> the rune of the gate is in fact two runes, the front and back. Also called the entrance and exit runes. My sister carries the front and I the back. Their powers are connected. Then it was Windy who tried to kill you. To increase her power, Windy tried to take the back rune of the gate from me. That's why I isolated myself on Magician's Island, setting up defences, biding my time. Awaiting the appearance of someone like you, Greeny. Listen to me, everyone. You're all travellers, stars that wander freely across the skies. And you have all assembled in a single spot. Together you will be victorious. The end of our war with the Empire is near. We've lost many lives. For our departed friends, for the future, we must battle on. We must bring an end to this conflict. Under the banner of the Liberation Army, under our leader, Commander Greeny. Victory! Victory!
<laughs> I love it. Rally the troops. Yo, better fight hard tomorrow. Right, Sidonia? Hey. Here we go. Oh, right. <laughs> the Lord screams to Gabby. Fix what you can fix. This is our last chance. <laughs> the wolves. I show cobalt power. You all follow Kuramimi. Aru. Just weird. It's just like two second scenes, you know? It's, it feels a bit weird. Okay. So, next thing we want to do. Oh, hold on. Let me just talk to him a sec. I'll have a choice anyway. Right, so... I want to save. I want to make sure that we got everything we can do. Two seconds. Here we go. I just asked her to join. So let's check the star wall again. I'm not sure if that counted. It didn't say. It didn't do the usual sort of noise that comes up when you recruit someone. Sonia, 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 Sonia. Where are you two? There you are. And we got her. Bloody hell. We could have missed her so easily. Oh, that's an easy one to miss. It's only, we got 107 stars now, so we haven't got the 108th, we haven't got Gremio. But, you know, we have essentially got him. You know, we've had him. So we can get the true ending, that's what I'm saying. So, this has been Green XI. Hope you've enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you again in a bit when we make a start and make our way over to the final dungeon. See you in a bit, folks.